that Texans team plays that Jets team ten times, I think they get their ass kicked seven times. And keep in mind, I'm saying there's no Nico Collins, there's no Tank Dell, there's no Dalton Schultz, and there's no Blake Cashman. That Texans team right there, without those guys, with that Jets team, which is a really good defense, they got the they got by far the two best skill position guys on on the field in Brees Hall. Because remember, Nico and Tank and, and Schultz are out. That Jets team lines up and kicks the Texans' ass seven out of ten times. I think it's as simple. Maybe I'm giving them excuses for injuries, but I don't. I don't look at this as like they had to dig deep. Now, do you want to lose by 24 points? No. I mean, that's not. That's not what's going to happen. But I think they lose that game to that team more times than not. I think we're treating the Texans as if they were full strength the other day and as if the Jets don't have a good defense. So that's it's I don't know if that makes you feel better or worse because you're probably going to you're, you're probably going to have that same squad against the Titans minus one of the best quarterbacks in the NFL. So maybe that means that the coaches they dig deeper and they try to figure something out. But that's that's how I look at this game. I don't look at it as, hey guys, you got you guys need to refocus. I look at it as they just got masked around by a team that was just built a lot better than they are without the pieces that they had. I mean, this two of the top fifteen receivers in the league yardage wise. Yeah. We're not talking about like we're not sitting here saying, Oh, you had one guy out there. Now the defensive performance shouldn't be that bad, but with that with with what they they had to I mean, it's just it, it, I don't even they didn't have a chance. I don't think that's outrageous. Uh, I, I really don't. And 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 I could argue. I, I I get the other side because it's it's C.J. Stroud, but I, I could argue that losing Will Anderson is almost as bad, if not as bad, uh, because of the yeah, defense. And then Will limped off the field too. Yeah. yeah so there you go. Because you're facing Derrick Henry, man. And I know he's not quite. Who's that? I know he's not quite what he used to be. Uh, but Derrick Henry, Derrick Henry against the Texans is like a video game.